Hello everybody, welcome to this channel. Today I'm going to show you how to add keyframing in CapCut. So for that, you have to follow my instructions very carefully. You can see that I'm on the interface of CapCut. So click on the button, new project and select the select your desired photo. So this is my background photo. Now I'm going to add an overlay where I'm going to use the keyframing effect. So I'm clicking the overlay option, add overlay and adding the logo of CapCut. So this is the logo I'm going to move anywhere using the keyframing. Beside this play and pause button, you can see a button with a square and plus, and this is the button for keyframing. But what actually keyframing means? Keyframing helps you to move the object very, very want. Like if you want to move this object from here to here, then here to here, you can do that using keyframing. So why are we waiting for? Let's do that. So let's select the first position of this logo at this place. So click on this button. So after that, at this point, I'm going to move the logo to that position. Okay, it is added. You can see that one red button has been added easily. Then again, at this point, the logo should be here. You can see that another red button has been added. And at the last point, the logo should be here so yes for keyframe has been added now let's see how it looks in this way you can move any objects in any direction you want you can also create any animation using this keyframing isn't that so much amazing so if this tutorial helped you don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel see you in the next one